Well, we've come to the end of another month, but there's plenty more where we have been and where we've come from. Today we're going to Psalm 4 verse 2 for our question which says, How long will you people turn my glory into shame? Now you have a relationship with the God of the universe. He has promised to be with you to the ends of the earth, to hear and answer your prayers, to empower you to meet every trial and challenge, and to fight your battles and overcome your enemies. This is just about the best news there is. However, with all this potential and power at your disposal, what are you accomplishing for and through him? What are you doing as his representative to further his kingdom? What great things are you striving to do with his help? Now to stay with this idea, let's look at just one verse in Exodus chapter 20, verse 7. It says, You shall not misuse the name of the Lord your God, for the Lord will not hold anyone guiltless who misuses the name. Now consider whether this refers to using God's name as a curse word, or if it really refers to having access to the name of the Lord to use in prayer and action and not doing anything with it. Wow, that changes at least my perspective on what it means to take the name of the Lord your God in vain, which we are commanded not to do. I want to use the power in the name in every way I can to accomplish my purpose and do God's will. And I want you to do the same. All right, that wraps up not only today, but it wraps up this month. But you come on back tomorrow and we're going to start another month. We've started all the other months with a question from God's Word.